So in this video I'm going to show you how to embed videos into your website or into your blog. Now most of the video sites are very very similar so if I show you how to do it at YouTube then most likely you can go to other sites and get the embedded code there. So what I'll show you first is how to embed any video into a blog and how to embed a video into your website. Now embedding videos into your blog, website, very very similar but there's a few things that you need to watch out for when you're inserting it into a blog or when you're inserting it into a website. So with that said I am at my YouTube account here and to get the video code what I want to do is find the video that I want to get the embed code for. So for this example in YouTube you would go to any video that you have those legal rights to embed the video. And as you can see here if I scroll down I have the how to customize your sales page as you can see here. If you scroll to the right you'll notice that it has the information here but it also has the embed code here. Now here's what I like about YouTube. If you click on customize most people they will leave it as the default so it'll look like this now the thing with this is you can customize it so you can show the border you don't have to but it kinda makes it look nicer and it stands out looks different than the other people so you can change it to different colors such as that in this example I'll just choose the regular gray now there are two choices here you can either include related videos or don't include related videos now what that means is let's say for example that I'm at the end of this video so I'll go all the way to the end of this video and if you notice at the end of the video it'll show different related videos now we don't want that so just go ahead and click don't include related videos once you have finished customizing the look and the customization of the video. What you want to do is copy this information here. So I would copy all of this, let's select all, then copy it. And once you have that copied, then we can go and take that and embed it or paste it into a blog, whether it's a blogger.com blog, WordPress blog, or a website. So the first thing I'm going to do is go to my WordPress blog and I'm going to write a new post. So I'll click on write and I'll just go ahead and name this test video. Now here's the thing that you want to watch out for. When you create a WordPress post, normally you're going to see it as a visual here. What you need to do is click this HTML link here and then paste that information there and then of course you can add tags and once you're done click on publish and if you want to see that blog in action we can go click on visit site and we see the test video here and we have the video that we just had over at YouTube customized with our border and to our liking. Now that is a WordPress blog and you can pretty much do the same thing anywhere else as long as you have the ability to enter HTML code which you pretty much can do anywhere else. Now the second thing I'm going to show you is how to take that embed code and implement it onto a website. Let's say for example that these are one of the videos that you're selling for instance the how to customize your sales page and you want to put it on your site as a demo in this case I'm gonna actually go to my cPanel of my website you can use FTP if you like uh, but I know the majority of you are probably on a cPanel hosting panel and you you might not exactly know how to use FTP if you do you're pretty much going to have no problem with this at all. Now I'm going to go to cPanel and what I want to do is I want to go to file manager 
And what I would like to do is create a new folder. So I, I'll click on new folder and I will enter a folder name and I'll call it video demo and we'll go ahead and create that folder and once I'm in that folder you'll notice that there are no records found just because we just created the folder and then I'll go ahead and create a new file and I'll name this index.html now if you're wondering okay where are you going with this I'm basically taking a blank page and embedding the code onto that blank page so if I go to code editor select it and click on code editor uh, then I go ahead and click on edit and without thinking I'll just go ahead and paste the embed code and I'll go ahead and save that so you'll notice the link here save changes and that's it so you'll notice that it is located in the slash video demo folder so what I'll do is I'll go to my website at uh, instant private label videos dot com slash video demo and if it's all successful then we'll notice that we have a video here and we can simply go ahead and play it I find this to be the easiest way to edit web pages simply by using cPanel X it also has a HTML editor which is very easy so for th those of you that don't want to use FTP uh, you can just go ahead and edit the pages on site but one thing to mention is that if you do edit it on site you need to be very careful because if you save it and you overwrite your information okay so with that said now you know what it looks like how to embed the video into a website and into a blog and it's actually very very easy as you can see and for sales purposes what I like the most is that you'll notice that it just has a replay so now you don't have to worry about people watching your videos and then seeing other videos at the end of the YouTube video area so with that said let's move on to the next video where I show you how to track your statistics